This video is going to look at the speed equation and the variables associated with it. The three variables are distance, time, and speed. The first variable is distance, which is defined as the length of a path traveled. Its variable symbol is a lowercase d, and the common SI units for distance are millimeters, centimeters, meters, and kilometers. The second variable is time, which is the duration between two events. The variable symbol for time is a lowercase t. Its common SI units are seconds, minutes, and hours. The third variable is speed, which is how fast an object is moving. Its variable symbol is a lowercase s, and its common SI units are meters per second, we're saying how many meters is that object moving in one second, and kilometers per hour. Again, how many kilometers is that object moving in one hour? So I've got a friend that's going to help us out for this next example. We're going to place him here, and we're going to take a look at the distance speed time triangle. It's a way to relate three variables, distance, speed, and time. The first thing we're going to do is write the equation for distance. Uh, what I'd like you to do now is place your hand over the variable you're looking for, or I'm going to place this gorilla over distance, and I'm going to write the remaining two variables exactly as I see them. So s is beside t. Rereading this, I can say distance equals speed times time. The next variable I'm going to solve for is time. Again, place your hand over the variable you're looking for, or I'm going to place the gorilla over time and rewrite that exactly as I see it. So distance is above speed. This means the formula for time equals distance divided by speed. And the third variable I'm going to solve for in this triangle is speed. S equals. We're looking for speed, so place your hand over that variable and rewrite exactly what you see distance over time. Again, this final formula can read speed equals distance divided by time. 